operate three instruments but not a microphone hello <laughs> there we go well my my uh, glasses are foggy as uh, I'm sure much of you experienced before so I can't see any of you but I'm so ha I can hear you and I can feel you and I'm so happy you all are here tonight um, hello to everybody out there I think I'm facing this way this way uh, in the uh, World Wide Web it's nice to be seen outside of my daily um, practice uh, trombone stuff on Facebook that's very unofficial. Um, anyways, this is a night dedicated to uh, Roy Hargrove. Um, it's also kind of a maiden voyage for my trumpet playing, which has allowed me to play with um, some of my favorite musicians in town. I mean, they actually are, um, starting with Andre Hayward, a teacher and mentor on trombone. I don't usually get to play a lot of gigs with him. Yes. Um, on drums, I've known him for a long time, an amazing drummer that lights a fire under your butt. We've got Daniel Dufour, let's give him a hand. He's such a, a joy to play, to play with. Behind me, my old schoolmate and such a melodic player with beautiful tone, we've got James Souter. Give him a hand. And the ever cerebral, Damien Garcia. Beautiful harmonies, such a, a wonderful player. I've known him for many years as well. But we're so happy to be here. Um, we're so thankful to Monks for hosting us. Colin Shook is doing an amazing job. This play, this is my first time here, and it's, it's, uh, it's, it's more, it's beyond what I could have uh, imagined. So thank you so much for having us and hosting us and keeping this alive throughout the, you know, the, the recent times. This has been a silver lining or a silver line to latch on to, you know, amidst everything else, so thanks, Colin. Yeah, Colin. Absolutely. Cool, well, we're gonna continue. I believe I've covered everything, yes, sir? I'll, uh, I'll come out of the table. Yeah, let's have Colin come up here, the man. Yeah. Thanks, Paul. Yeah. Um, thank you all for coming to the studio tonight and for all of you guys out there on the World Wide Web, as Paul said. Uh, we are streaming here uh, about you know, eight or 10 or 12 times a month, we have a great uh, thing going on here, being able to present so many of the musicians around town. Uh, I just want to let you guys know about a few dates we have coming up. Um, let's see, this Friday night, we have the Quinn Sternberg Quartet. They are coming out of New Orleans. Quinn is a great uh, upright bass player. Been uh, to all, all over the country studying and all this stuff, but um, we're very happy that they can uh, make the date to come out here. Uh, we just got word that they are able to confirm they're coming out. Everything's coming back online out there. And then we're back here on Tuesday night, the 21st, with the Austin Jazz Society and the Alex Koch Quintet. So they'll be naming some Austin Hall of Famers. And uh, the Austin Jazz Society's Project Safety Net series is, is uh, back in full swing here at Monk's. And then we will be celebrating our fifth anniversary on Thursday the 23rd. Uh, it'll be featuring my trio. We've got uh, Daniel on the drums and Ryan Hagler on the bass, and we're gonna have a bunch of guests coming in for that. So uh, please tune in online. If you'd like to come see any of these shows down here at Monks, you can go to our website and purchase tickets there. But everybody tuning in online, uh, if you'd like to support this group, we do have a very limited studio audience here in the building. Uh, and if you could leave five or 10 or 20 bucks, just go to that PayPal or Venmo, you know, leave what you might pay for as a cover at a club, a couple drinks, all that. Your financial support goes so far to help keep these musicians motivated and playing and all that stuff. I mean, everybody does it out of passion anyway, but the money definitely uh, helps immensely. So with that said, thank you guys for coming. What do you have up next, man? Go ahead and put this mic down and we're gonna play some more music for you all. I can't remember what we have next, but we're sure to find out.
God damn it. Woo! Let me get a, my breath there. <laughs> so, uh, I, some talking some shop here. Uh, it's gonna be riveting. Um, <laughs> I uh, am originally. Let me just turn this on before I start. I'm uh, originally a trombone player. Um, I started trombone at 11 years old, and I started trumpet at 34, and I'm 35 now. I think 33 or 34. So anyways, actually the main point here is the air, the amount of air that I use between these instruments, and I'm still trying to put trombone air through these small trumpets, and it's killing me. But it's been such a, a practice in restraint and a continuation of that. So um, actually, I don't know where I was going with this, but uh, I'm going to keep playing for you all. And it's actually uh, so much fun to be working all this stuff out um, in front of folks, finally. So um, thanks again for coming. And we're going to play another tune. I think it's going to be a ballad. So we hope you enjoy it. We're gonna uh, feature the ever ever lyrical um, Andre Hayward on this tune, um, and I'm, I'm gonna play a little bit of flugel, but this is gonna be a trombone feature. Thank you. 
Darn That Dream is the name of that tune. Beautiful ballad, one of my all-time favorites. Um, we're going to continue. What's the next tune, fellas? Oh, yeah. We're going to continue with a, a, a classic. Um, what do they call it? A flagship of a, of a, what would you say, a genre of jazz, of bebop? I'm sure there's lots of, many, many names, but we're going to go ahead and play this Charlie Parker classic for you all, and we hope you enjoy it.
Thank you all very much. Uh, that was uh, Parker's mood, I believe. Is that correct, Andre? Is my memory? Sometimes there's spots in my memory, you know. 35 years old. It's not a good sign. Just kidding. Parker's mood. Thank you for having us here at Monks with Colin Shook hosting us this evening. And we've got some folks out in the audience that are keeping us company as well. It's intimate here, and we hope that you all are enjoying it at home. I'm going to go ahead and introduce this band again because it's been a little bit, and these guys deserve a ton of recognition. Okay, I'm going to start from the other side of the stage here. On my left, stage right, we've got Damian Garcia on the piano. Give him a hand. Behind me, we went to school together. I really love this guy's playing. It is about the U. We've got James Suter on the bass. on the drums, an old friend and a wise food sage. <laughs> he has all the hookups, all the knowledge of the food in town. He's the man. Daniel DeFore on drums, everybody. Another wise one, my mentor, someone I who I look up to uh, uh, greatly. We've got Andre Hayward on the, on the uh, trombone. <laughs> I forgot my own instrument. <laughs> We're gonna play a few, a few more tunes with you all. Colin, did you wanna come up here and uh, say a few words to the kind people out there? Sure. Oh, please. <laughs> please, God. <laughs> Colin Shook, everybody. Yeah. Colin Shook. One more time for Paul Deemer. And uh, we're seeing your applause out here on the stream. Thank you for the uh, mighty few out there leaving all the fire emojis, clapping hands emojis, the little piano emojis. Like, that's such a ubiquitous and vague yet participatory <laughs> way to <laughs> enjoy the show and, and leave the clapping hands things. You know, it's, it, it's really awesome to see that. Um, if you guys could also <laughs> share this video on your you know, Facebook timelines or your Twitter pages, maybe even your LinkedIn, that'd be amazing. Um, we're also here on YouTube, if you're here on YouTube. Sorry, that was a really bad uh, LinkedIn reference. If you're here on uh, YouTube, please hit that big, big red subscribe button. We have so many concerts on the stream. I think we're just around 185 of these concerts, just like this, since the, since the pandemic started. We've had so many amazing musicians on the stage. So you guys in the house, this video will be live immediately. So you can even re-listen to it on your way home. Uh, there's all these other concerts. We started streaming in 2.5K about a month ago. So the audio and the video are coming through. There's all these weird particulars. We're trying to get the bis biggest and best quality of uh, sound and video from the stage out to you guys at home. So please do leave a tip at the Venmo and the PayPal up there. Again, we have a very limited studio audience. We are in stage five here in Austin, which is making the music scene and including us, um, you know, very, uh, it, live music is a very fragile thing in these times. So if you can, you know, lend five or 10 or 20 bucks, we might give it back, we might not, but uh, please leave those tips, support these guys and tune in for our upcoming shows. You can find those at monksjazz.com. Thank you guys.
All right, I think I've got everything coordinated, mask and uh, microphone-wise. That was the fastest I've done it. Okay, that was a tune entitled Mr. Clean. And Damien, who did you say that was by? Wellman Irvin. Weldon, Weldon Irvin. I did not know that. Okay, very good. We're going to go ahead and, uh, yes, it is made famous by Freddie Hubbard and actually... Uh, um, played in continuity on what was it, Ear Food, Freddie Hubbard's? Oh, yeah. 
yeah. album Ear Food. Yeah, that's a wonderful album. It's an amazing album. But we're going to go ahead and play another uh, Roy tune entitled Roy Allen. I believe it's after his father, but I'm not entirely sure. Okay. We hope you enjoy.
Thank you. That was Roy Allen by Roy Hargrove. What a fun tune. Very smooth. All right. I'm going to introduce this terrific band before we play our last song. Uh, thank you so much to Colin and Monks for hosting us. And yes, yeah, so let's give them a hand. There he is, sir. And also, thank you so much for the uh, contained audience that we have inside here. Thank you all for coming out tonight and, uh, and sharing your presence. We really appreciate it. Let's give these folks a hand, band. Thank you so much. We hope to see you all again real soon. Um, on my far left, I'm eating this uh, mask here. Mm, uh, I've, on drums, I've got Daniel Dufour, my, one of my favorite drummers. In front of him on trombone, we've got the great, inimitable Andre Hayward. In the middle of the stage, my friend, James Souter, on bass. <laughs> and on piano, also inimitable. And a very good friend, uh, Damien Garcia. All right. Well, thanks again. We, we hope to see you soon. Thank you all. This is the Paul Deemer Quintet. Feel free to uh, follow my um, social mediums to get any additional news. I'll be playing out more. I've, uh, I mentioned it um, on uh, Facebook. It's been two years since I've done a Monk show, I believe, maybe over, and three since I've done a show under my own band name, under my own name with the band. So um, it's nice to get back uh, you know, out there on the saddle, and uh, we hope to do it again soon. All right. We're going to play our last tune, and thank you all so much.
That was Firm Roots by Cedar Walton. Thanks, thank you all again so much for coming out, and we'll see you next time. Take care, everybody. Have a great night. Thank you.